hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are going to do the deleting part okay so guys this is a delete button where if i click this button this id number five data should get deleted directly okay so we are not asking any confirmation or anything so when we click it should get deleted directly okay so confirming and all will be done in the next continuing videos okay so guys now let us first we'll finish with this deleting thing so guys this is my delete button where this is created so as a simple we are going to create a form okay and method is equal to post and now i will create a simple button b o t t o n button that will be submit done and let us name this as delete and let's copy this class for the designing purpose that is a bootstrap class so copy and let's remove this done so there is no confusion and let us call a url that will be the route so guys you can just mention as about as delete with the id forward slash dot dollar data of its id okay so before that we have to call the csrf field okay csrf underscore field function okay and one more for the method that will be to delete okay f i e l d field that is to delete if it is to update we should put or put or patch okay now it is delete means so we are using delete thing okay so guys now let us copy this url and get get our to our route okay so let us go to route and let us route it with the delete function and let's call this and give a forward slash with the dollar id not dollar id just the id and call your controller that is about us controller so inside admin folder so i'm just going to copy paste and let us call this function as delete so let's copy this function okay this is the function copying it and let's go to our about us controller that i have already opened it and let's create a function public function where we are going to paste your name not name the route function name this delete one okay so guys now let us create a variable call about us is equal to and your model eloquent model we are going to find or tell a fail state condition with the dollar id which dollar id you are passing through it through the route this id so let us copy that id into this function and we will provide this id to here okay so guys now let us just copy this variable paste it and call the delete function that's it done and let's return and redirect back to the same page that is about us page okay so about us about us when i click this it should redirect to the same page with the message called data deleted for about us done so guys now let us just test this in a simple way it, we have finished this form check the route with the id so it is going to the route with the id at its controller and this is the code that's it so let us give control r so after control r let us try with the deleting with this fifth id so i'm going to click on this delete and boom the data is deleted for about us that is the id5 is not visible now okay it's deleted so guys in this video that's it we have completed the crud that is create update i mean read edit update and delete so guys in next videos we will be doing the data table that is for the search bar and the pagination thing 
using data table and in another video we'll be doing with the confirmation of deletion part okay so guys thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share